Hello. Ooh. That's a sweet 60 frames per second logo drop there. Hello and welcome back to Daddy's Bingo. So right here we get the, uh, I, I just got this. I, I didn't have this collection. I had to purchase it. I bought it for me. Just to have a good time with. And you know, I think that's what we're going to do. Yeah, this is good. So, these uh, games on this list here are actually not in the chronological order. They're in the they're in the release order of the game. And I mean, you know what? I've looked into it, and if you're gonna play all of these games, uh, you should probably play them in the order they were released. If we had to actually decide exactly how to play them. If you're going to play them at all, and you want to play all of them, play them in the order they were released. That seems right. So we got Kingdom Hearts uh, Final Mix. That's the one we're going to play. I like these little, uh, these like Louis Vuitton looking fashion fabric patterns going on on the right side here. Very responsive menu, very good. Got people in the chat already dunking on the games. Everybody just wants to dunk on Kingdom Hearts. Kingdom Hearts looks it's just looks like a basketball hoop to most people. So we've got uh people saying the uh games have titles that look like Ableton project names. Like email subjects you get from your boss. Anyway. We're gonna go ahead and uh we're gonna go ahead and get started. We can watch the credits. We're gonna play Kingdom Hearts Final Mix, the very first game. And yeah, it's got um it's got just the cutscenes from three five eight over two days. I mean three five eight days over two. So you're properly supposed to say that. For some reason, it's here, even though it was released after Kingdom Hearts 2. However, it was released before the uh, this Kingdom Hearts HD 1.5 mix. So, uh, I'm not going to play any of those. We're just going to jump right in. Oh, Dream Drop Distance isn't in here. It is available to watch the Dream Drop Distance cutscenes by a download. You can get a download uh, theater mode to watch those. We're not going to do that. We're just going to play a video game is what we're going to do. Start playing Kingdom Hearts Final Mix. Very responsive 60 FPS cursor. So, yeah, I bought this 1.5, 2.5 combo pack. $49.99. You know, just... Uh, just for fun. Not really for any particular reason. Well, Tarzan is owned by Edgar Rice Burroughs. That's good. It's good that the old uh, ERB gets shouted out. And we're going to just start a new game. We're going to start brand new. Final Mix Beginner. We're going to go ahead and... Uh, I don't really want thrilling battles. I want to enjoy my Disney characters. Automatically rotate. We're going to manually rotate our camera. I actually enjoy some combination of manual and automatic in my 3D RPG video games. I like when the camera automatically adjusts. Dragon Quest is a nice option for that. I gotta say, I'm really impressed with the frame rate. Now, when I originally played this game, I played it on PlayStation 2. I played it brand new. Right when it was new. 
and uh, it sure as heck weren't no 60 FPS on there. I've been having these weird thoughts lately. Oh, is he seeing dead people? I believe that was the joke I made the very first time I uh, played this game. Like, is any of this for real? Or not? Yesterday I was watching some cutscenes for uh, Kingdom Hearts Key Unchained whatever it's called and it had some really stilted difficult to watch voice acting oh my god I love this I just I love PlayStation 2 FMV especially this uh, this this Final Fantasy uh, 10 slash Final Fantasy 8 looking stuff Final Fantasy X goes for more of a, a, a textiles approach where you can kind of feel the the fabric of the, of the costumes, whereas in this it's a little bit more uh, video game clown aesthetic. Piero core, as we would call it. So the song is actually, the original version of the song is pretty cool. And I was confused as to why there's like this remix of it in the game and not just like the song also I've never heard the English version of this song I played these games in Japanese so this is, uh, we, we're introduced to this game, but he's saying he's been having weird thoughts and he's wondering if any of this is real or not. Are these his weird thoughts? Is this what he's wondering is real or not? Because, uh, man, the beginning of this game is like a, you know, a weird thought to me. Cause it's not that I don't remember it per se, it's just feels like it was a god darn lifetime ago. Was he just imagining spoilers for the story or is that just the theatricality of a video game intro cutscene? Ooh, that is 1080p. So much to do, so much to owe, so little time. Take your time, don't be afraid. Are they, is that, talk, are they talking about Kingdom Hearts? Like, play the game nice and slow? Oh, it's testing my controls. Tilt it slightly to walk all the way around. If you can't figure this out, you're uh, gonna have a hard time getting through the games. I like these tutorials where they No matter what speed I walk, he's going to cut immediately into that speed he was walking there. Okay, so here's where I get to choose between three things. Little personality test. So. Oh, there we go. Look at these little tiny hops I can do, or I can do a real big one. So. I get to choose one of these three things. The game starts me looking right at the sword. And it makes the shield and the magic wand into uh, choices. So I'm just gonna go ahead and we're gonna go for the sword. I'm gonna go straight for what was, well. The power of the warrior, invincible courage, a sword of terrible destruction. Sounds chill. Yeah, let's do it. Oh. I pressed the Japanese confirm button. What will you give up in exchange? Uh, I think I'm gonna give up. I'm just gonna, like, saunter over to the shield. 
So, everybody tell me, should I give up on the shield? Alright, we're gonna give up the shield. People are telling me to give up on the shield. Kindness to aid, friends. See, I know that... One of my two bros is going to have a shield. Yeah. And so now I'm going back to Earth. Looks like we get a little bit of Cinderella. These 30 FPS cutscenes are just jarring against that 60 FPS gameplay. Oh yeah, I love how he hunkers while holding the sword. He like, yeah, there we go. Good. Oh, that's all. All I needed was one slash to be declared that I've got it. I like how they say protect yourself and others. All right. I gotta kill a couple of these chumps. Ooh, so when I first played this game, I mean, this is old news, I believe. Anybody. But you had to use the uh, trigger buttons on the PlayStation 2 controller to rotate the camera. Long time ago. Yeah, I like those items. He really does hunker down with that sword. Look at that. He holds that sword like a, uh... He already got all the items, bro. He just holds the sword like he's, uh, you know, like a kid in an orphanage. At lunch in the orphanage. You know, doesn't want anybody else to steal his meal. Lock on the target, pressing R1, lock on the, I gotcha. Also, it's just like Dark Souls. Kingdom Hearts is all about locking on to dudes, uh... It's all about locking on to dudes in lieu of rotating the camera. He's not liking whatever's happening to him now. Can you imagine what he's going through? He's just freaking out. He's never even like... So, Sora, it's important to know, unlike you and me, Sora's grown up in a world that does not have Disney properties for entertainment for children. So he's getting all confronted with Snow White and Cinderella. He doesn't know what he's looking at. Can you imagine how trippy that would be? If you've never seen a cartoon before. And then suddenly you're just seeing Snow White and Cinderella. I'm gonna go over and get this box. I hope that Disney buys a... Square Enix, and then makes a movie about the bouncer, so that Kingdom Hearts 3.2 can have the bouncer in it. I'm just gonna hit this. Give me whatever was in there. I'm using the items. I'll use that. Okay. 
airlock on the objects as well as the symbols. very first barrel that we break in the game results in the door being unlocked. Why is that a thing? I don't know. Has anyone, uh... Yeah, I realize that Kingdom Hearts 2 has, uh... Has some... Has, has some the bouncer dog street stuff in it. The door won't open just yet. Oh man, this owns. So we've seen Snow White and Cinderella, now we're seeing, uh... Okay, I got you. We've got Selfie, Waka, and Titus. Okay, I'll do it. What am I afraid of? Heck! You know, a lot of these, uh, this is like an old Japanese RPG tradition to start a game with a, sort of a personality test questionnaire. So it's like, where you just kind of answer honestly about who you are in the human world, and then the game fashions a Dungeons and Dragons character sheet out of that. I gotta say, I, uh, I'm not afraid of any of these things in real life. Somebody tell me, we're hearing that top, the, to the answer's on the top level, you quick in the beginning, but slow in the end game. Does that scale? Does the middle answer average it out, and does the uh, bottom answer do the opposite? Kit Clayton says, don't you complain about being old in like every video? Wow, you hear that as a complaint? I cite that as a qualification. So I should take the bottom one on everything because I want to be powered up in the end game, right? Middle is consistent leveling. Should I take the bottom? Somebody tell me. Somebody who knows the game, tell me. Yes? I don't know what that yes is in re to. Okay, well, I'm hearing it twice now. <laughs> Go ahead and take the bottom one. Okay. Yeah. If I want that, then yes. Being indecisive. Okay. What do you want, Selfie? Most important to you. Oh, shoot. Um. Well, no, Starlad91. I wasn't afraid of being indecisive. I was just doing it. That was my joke, actually. I meant to make that joke before making that choice. About how I'm not afraid of any of those things. Friendship. Prize possessions being my most important thing. This makes me sound selfish. But I'm going to take the bottoms. Yeah, because without your possessions, what do you have? I keep pressing X to talk. I'm sorry. Do I have one out of life? You know, actually, I do want to be strong. But I do want to see rare sights. My horizons, I'll tell you what. I, uh... I was once homeless in Morocco. Okay. My horizons are pretty broad. Let's just go ahead and say to be strong, because I do want to be strong. I love being strong. I'm afraid of being indecisive. You like to collect neat things. You want to be strong. I could not... There is no farther statement from the truth. I do not like collecting anything. I think collecting things is weird. To be perfectly honest. My adventure begins in the dead of night. A rising sun awaits your journey's end. Okay, let's go. The day you open the door is both far off and very near. That's... See, that's baby talk. I'm sorry. I'm about to make a video staunchly defending this game. I mean, celebrating this game. While the music is definitely better than it was when I first played this game, I remember the music being, uh... 
being like really tinny and midi and kind of like clown bloops though it's like really really polished up this this remaster is great I can see myself actually playing through these games now because of this um, but it's like the 60 FPS is one thing oh no Sora's getting hit I gotta get my little uh, skittles He's only able to taste uh, one particular part of the rainbow, it looks like. The day I open the door is both far off and very near. It's, again, it's it's hard to defend uh, dialogue like that. I'm sorry. Though, yeah, my, my earlier, like, the complaints I had about Kingdom Hearts when I played it, um, I had a couple. Mostly I was just being a jerk. But publicly, uh, I complained a lot on my blog about the frame rate, about the camera being too close, about the music being clown bloopy. Though it's like, I really feel like, uh, okay, I want to save it, man. I want to save it. I really feel like the game needed to be widescreen. It really needed to be widescreen. Back on the PlayStation 2. And now that it's widescreen, I feel like they've solved most of my complaints. I mean, they didn't just remaster this game. They, there were apparently large parts of it that were lost that they had to recreate, which I find fascinating. Just the dedication to throw together a game this huge. Oh, now we got Belle from Beauty and the Beast. The closer you get to light, the greater your shadow becomes. Oh, yeah. Zelda 2, The Adventure of Link, going on over here. It's telling me don't be afraid. Man, Sora is freaking out. So I like how he's yet to speak a single word so far in the game. Giving us that RPG silent protagonist feeling before we uh, get to know he has a personality. So this guy, I can tell he's a chump. I gotta hit his hand. Now when I was a kid back in the 90s and the 80s, if a boss in a game was big, that's what you, uh, that's what you told your friends. Get this game, it has a really big boss in it. Get Wrath of the Black Manta, the first boss is huge. I feel like Tetsuya Nomura remembers that era. He remembered it well. I don't mean, uh, keep forgetting to, uh, crike him. Oh my god, eat the Skittles. Taste the rainbow. Alright, taste the rainbow, buddy. Oh man, I need to kill one of these guys to get his Skittles. I'm glad I chose the power of the sword because that means I own. Um, is the princess for this room Belle from Beauty and the Beast because I'm fighting a beastly monster? Look at his curly tipped elf shoes that he's wearing. I guess I'm not hitting this guy. Anymore. I just don't really know what to do when I don't have my buddies goofy and help me out. Okay. Oh, me done leveled up. This guy's some big weird Cthulhu Medusa. Ego Shadow the Colossus Monster. Well, I did it. Yeah, I'm not afraid, yo.
The mightiest weapon of all is Sora's heart. Wait, is that what the mightiest weapon is? Or is it the Keyblade? It's not the Keyblade, because it doesn't have that yet. The door. Is that the door to Kingdom Hearts? Oh, here we go. We get to hang out on my big baby island. Oh, beautiful ocean. Sora's Whoa. first words in the timeline are a yawn. That's good. <laughs> Give me a break, Kyrie. So are you lazy That's Kyrie. bum? Oh man. I knew that I'd find you snoozing down. She calls here. him Sora. No, this huge black thing swallowed me up. I couldn't breathe, I couldn't Ow. Are you still dreaming? It wasn't a dream. Or was it? Or was it? Know. It wasn't a dream. What was that place? Or was it? it? So bizarre. So sure. Hanley Joel Osment was uh, 13 years old Say when Kyrie. recorded the voiceover. What was your hometown like? You know, where you grew up? I've told you before. I don't remember. Boom, Nothing amnesia. At all? Nothing. You ever want to go back? Mm, Why would you go back well, to a place you don't remember, you weirdo? Read the room, buddy. Really? But you know. Why would you want to leave I this place? I wouldn't want to see it. I'd like to see it too. Along with You'd any like to other see this place you know there. nothing about. I want to see them all. He wants to see all the worlds. So what are we waiting for? Hey, aren't you guys forgetting about me? So, oh, so here's what you need to know about Riku. I guess I'm the only one working on the raft. Riku's a good boy. <laughs> it's just he, just, just he gets confused. He is. <laughs> so you know this. Okay. Kyrie, we'll she's all right. I'll race you. Huh? And Sora, all you need to know about him kidding? is he's a good boy who means the best. Ready? Riku's a really good boy who just gets very confused. And if you can't empathize with that, then that's on you, not on him. <laughs> Why was Rik uh, Kaede the only one making uh, making an exuberant uh, giggling noise while running? Ah, oh, there's the title screen. Disney Square Enix, Kingdom Hearts, Final Mix. That Smash Bros. looking font on the Final Mix that... GameCube is heck looking. Ah oh, man, this remaster is good. Destiny Islands. Bungie will have something to say about this. Gotta love those shoes though. You ever want to get uh, just the biggest pair of shoes you can get? Okay, I'm gonna gather the supplies. Yeah, I'm listening. Wow, the very first dialogue option it offers me in front of my uh, friend is to say I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Two logs, one claw, one rope. You're going to make a raft out of two logs? No more slacking. Wow. So, Sora has, prior to the start of the game, sullied the player's name by slacking. I obtained the log. I'm actually just gonna chill on the island for a little bit. Hey Walker, how you doing? Hey, hey weren't you in what's my dream? Happening, man? Huh? Wait. A serious question. Is is that Waka's English voice because I didn't play Final Fantasy X in English? I thought he was uh, John DiMaggio, uh, aka the face Marcus feels Phoenix. Great. Jake the dog. It's not it's not his actual voice, okay. And I mean, Selfie didn't have a voice. How weird that Selfie became the most famous Final Fantasy character of all of them. She created the whole idea of taking a picture of your own face with your phone camera. And it's, she's, literally her name is synonymous with it. Hey, how you doing, Tita? Hey, Sora, you feel lucky today? Oh wait, his name is Titus because it's he's American. In, in the Japanese version, his name is Tita. Oh man, I got a big wooden blade. Some goddamn Never Never Land looking Peter Pan, Lost Boys kind of sword. 
just just boys being boys. Oh, fixed camera in here. So it occurs to me that in levels like this, Kingdom Hearts is kind of like Zelda on caffeine. You know what I mean? Where did he put his sword? So I need cloth and logs. Just another day in paradise. Climbing ladders, running down walkways, scrounging for cloth and logs. There's the rope. Give me that rope. Yeah. Okay. I love it. I have not played this game in literally 17 years. just these humble beginnings. It, it becomes so much more than this. Let's go to the seaside shack. Oh, we can save. We're going to save it to a new file. Someone in the chat is saying this music is not so good. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting that the items don't actually look like items. The items just, they, they look like objects in the game world. I don't think you're supposed to listen to this song more than like three times. Yeah, the items just look like part of the world. Alright, I need a log now, another log. I bet it's over there. I bet I have to go over to this little island, is that correct? Oh, I wouldn't actually know because I can't get in there. Um, see, how much more of a video game do you need than this? Just, you know, just kind of hang around. Wow, he destroyed that object and obtained no item. Taking a shower. You're not going to hit a tree with a vertical slash. There's the coconuts. Yeah, I don't think he can eat those coconuts. It must be hard to climb a tree with shoes that big. I don't know where this other log is. I need to log on and find it. I wanted to hit Titus. I wanted to hit him. Oh man. You gotta really go for it if you wanna jump off the edge. Maybe she'll let me go with just these. One log. Stop telling me I'm slacking. I don't know where the log is. I 
just don't see where a log could be. Over to here? I have to go over here, probably, right? But how do I get there? Oh, okay. Now I'm thinking with my kingdom hearts here. So here's the thing that kind of always bugs me about kingdom hearts is the skybox looks like it's like 20 feet up. Like I'm in the lobby of the Venetian Resort Hotel in Las Vegas. Where they painted it to look like a sky. But that kind of actually owns, because it makes it feel like a Disneyland theme park ride. Let's go. I can't wait to fight Riku. I wish I could dodge. I don't have the dodge yet. No, I don't. You don't get the dodge until later. Listen to the Sonic Adventure sound of music. You kicked me in the face. I'm gonna die. Do tell me you're giving up already. You're gonna lose. Oh my god. I still don't got it. I got waste. I'm gonna try him again. Let's go again, bro. We're gonna actually get him. I was reading the chat and I fell off the side. Alright, let's actually fight him again. Alright, let's go. What does he have to say, you still don't got it? What am I doing? Climb the tree. I'm not giving up. Come on up here and hit me. Wow, he just... I went up that tree and he just had no way of telling that I was uh, still up there. Oh my god. I just jumped in. Oh, stop it. I wish I could block or dodge. What do you mean giving up? I'm running around. You can try to come hit me. Oh my god. Don't tell me you're giving up already. Hey. Tech one point. Oh, get off you of the tree, you it. idiot. Yeah. Grabbing the tree causes you to... Uh... Yeah. Okay, so when he's down, he's going to do that. Oh, come on. Yeah, I realize I'm supposed to lose. Okay. Is it possible to win? Never mind. I don't even care. I could beat him if I had, like, an ability. Yeah, I bet. I can win. I'll, uh... I'm gonna go ahead and not win. We're just gonna go ahead and get on with the game. Yeah, let's go home. Wait, are we not home already? Don't we just live on this beach? I would rather live on the beach. So, 
Kyrie's home is out there somewhere, right? Did you notice how the Could music be. just kind of kept going? We'll never know by staying here. Even as they transitioned into but the. How uh, far could a rat take us? Who knows? Thought he said, "How far could a rat take us?" If You're gonna ride over to. there on a rat? Think of something else. So, suppose you get to another world. <laughs> what would you do there? So these people hmm. believe not that the Earth is well, flat. I, they believe that there are really other planets in the ocean. It's just. I've always That's on a whole different level here, and I love this it. Island. If there are any other worlds out there, why did we end up on this one? You ended up on this and one because uh, some sinister wizard worlds. banished you all there. Then ours is before, just a uh, like 100 of years ago. Much greater. So, we could have just as easily ended up somewhere else, right? I don't know. Exactly. That's why we need to go out there and find out. Just sitting here won't change a thing. It's the wow. Same old stuff. So let's go. You so they don't live on the lately. beach, How but do you? they sleep on this tree? Thanks when he you. said let's go home, if you hadn't come here, I probably would have never thought of any of this. Oh. Carrie, thanks. <laughs> You're welcome. I would personally want to leave too if Zora. my home didn't even have a nighttime music track. If it sounded the one, same at night as you? it did during the day. A pow poo fruit. Pow poo. If two people share one, their destinies become intertwined. They'll remain a part of each other's lives, no matter what. I think our destinies have been intertwined Come for on, a different reason for a longer it. time than this. <laughs> I think Riku's up to something. That's all I'm saying. I don't want to spoil anything for anybody, but I think Riku's up to something. Oh my god, the Magic Kingdom. Okay, here we go. Now we're ready. Oh my god, give me that Donald Duck. Give me that duck. I love that goofy, stupid duck. One's a goofy duck. One's a dog named Goofy. Together, they're bros. Oh my god, Donald, dude. <laughs> there he is, man. I love Donald Duck. No, this is not my first playthrough of this game. I played this game 17 years ago. So, it pretty much feels like the first time. Gotta say, I love I love this remaster. This remaster's good. He's like, what? <laughs> Oh god, he left Pluto behind. You gotta admit, Mickey Mouse leaving Pluto behind immediately suspicious. Look at those polygon eyes. You gotta love hearing that weirdo quack, you know? When he's just completely flustered. And quacking like he's electrocuted. His only friend in the world is, of course, Goofy. Man. God, I love Goofy, too. Hey, Goofy rules. Oh, yeah. Mickey Mouse is missing. It's a lot like Star Wars Episode 7. They've got to find him. He's gone to the original Disney temple. Uh, we've got a problem, Goofy. Queen Minnie? You want to know something? Everybody's got a... Everybody's got a goofy Lazy. impression. Gorsh! Right? But nobody has a Donald oh, Duck impression. Morning, nobody has a good Donald Duck impression. We call that inimitable. He is an inimitable <clears throat> individual. You can't have what Donald Duck has got. And yeah, I would say that... Uh, Donald is C-3PO and Goofy is R2-D2. Just with their proportions a little bit, uh, a little bit reversed. Oh, we're back on 60 FPS island after that 30 FPS cutscene. Doesn't this music just really make you want to go live island life? Alright, I'm going to fight these guys. 
Man, I love these 60 frames. I actually, I, I, I dead Pizza? serious want to. Have you heard about the legendary? Yeah, I've heard about it. It's if two people eat it, their destinies become intertwined. Yeah. If you share it with someone you really then your destinies for. become intertwined. Yes. It binds you together forever and ever through eternity. Yeah. <sighs> that sounds sick it's and so weird. Romantic. I gotta try that it. That actually sometimes. sounds terrible. I'm not. I'm not joking. Let's go around. Wow. Okay, okay, here we go. Alright, selfie. Yeah. Hopefully she doesn't block every single Five. attack. What? I remember beating her the first time I played the game. Heck oh. Kingdom Hearts actually... Uh, wow, she really is not... Okay. Yeah, don't yell, are you ready, before you hit me. I got one experience point. That's good. Or one point. I don't think I got lucky. I think I, uh... I think I, uh... I think I just hit you a million times while you weren't doing anything. Alright, you want some? Hey, big bro. We are gonna do a little exploring today. Wait, does he have this accent in the English version? Does he have an accent like this? Let me know. Oh, that water was really loud. Yeah, let's go around. Oh. Uh, I will not be showing you my stuff. What? Sorry, I keep misjudging the length of my attack. Ooh! I got brutalized. I need my... There we go. Just get your teeth in there. Get your teeth in. What? He just parried me. What, you punk? Oh my god, I got wasted! We got someone in the chat saying they used to farm tech XP on this fight. Show me your stuff. What's the uh, what's the technique for? Uh, how do I get a tech point on him? What's what's the easy way? So there actually is there is stuff to the action in Kingdom Hearts. Like when I first played this game, I sort of. You know, I teased it a little bit for having simplistic action, but it's like... It's, it's a lot better than... Uh, way better than it could be. Like, I actually have to dodge this guy's attack. I feel like I'm actually dodging. When you're fighting against, like, 20 million dudes... What? Come on? Don't tell me come on. I am coming on. Come on, you chump. Oh, you freak. Oh my god, you got walloped. You got turned into a pile of trash. Oh, I can hit the ball. Oh, I could have hit the ball back at him. Well, it's too late to do that now. It's time to continue my serial killing and go get Titus. I love how he just does a somersault from one hand and then flips up. All right, Titus. He's the stand-in for Riku. I think you've gotten stronger, but odds are you're still no match for Riku. Yeah, I'm still no match we for Riku. I know. We one last time. He whipped us all. Well, I guess Kairi can always count on him. Um, I would like to fight a few rounds. No. But he asked down. me if I wanted to go a few rounds. Huh. Yeah. Oh. You creep. I'm just jumping. I'm jumping to just appear ostentatious. I'm trying to, uh... I'm trying to fight stylishly, but it's not working. Forget it. I keep pressing the circle button to jump because I keep feeling like... 
that's the button I would like to press to perform some sort of defensive roll maneuver. My god, this shrill hockey clacks on screaming at me as I try to fight. That's not gonna not get old, let me tell you. I I wanted to die. I I genuinely wanted to die. Because I did not want to uh, Oh, tiny jumps into combos. Let's try that. Oh, uh, well, he's not hes not jumping alongside me. Oh, my God. Okay, sorry. I'm now right back to the hockey clacks on again. Oh, my Lord. Oh my god! God dang it! Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I want some other technique than hit. I want to be able to do something to, uh... Something resembling a kind of a tick. Oh, I got two tick points, that's good. I don't want to just dodge and hit. Tita sucks. Come on, Titus. Where's your blitz ball blade now? Oh man, I remember that Squall is in this. Squall rules. He's got like really long hair. He's like older. Titus is younger. And Squall is older. The years that have been drained from Titus have been injected into Squall. See, he got turned into a punk that time because I paid attention. Oh, uh, you got owned, kid. I mean, he got straight busted. I'm sorry. I turned him into horse trash. I'm gonna go into the seaside shack. We're gonna go ahead and give the game another C. You know why? Because, uh... It's good to save. 48 minutes in to Kingdom Hearts 1. I'm not sure if this is an agreed-upon, like, correct length of time. Like, a correct amount of activity to perform in this first 48 minutes. I think I probably could have done more. Let's go to the cove. How you doing, Riku? The rats still need to man. How about high wind? Oh my god. Name of the rap. Oh my god. I get Final Fantasy references. What shall I call it? Does this later become the name of my gummy ship? is kind of hard to look at. Oh. Tr oh my god. I keep... Hold on, no, no, sorry. I know what to call it. Let's see how quickly I can enter this game now. We're going to go ahead and call it the Heck Truck, which is actually what the name of the truck in Truck Heck is. It is called the Heck Truck. <laughs> yeah, bro. Oh, the usual. All right. You guys at it again? All right. I'll be the judge. So if this is the usual, she is... Uh, She's being the judge of the huge. The huge rules apply. Take any route you want. First one to the star wins. 
Oh, it's a tank. If I win, uh, I'm captain. I'm captain. And if you win, I get to uh, share look at me. Huh? I'm the captain now. Deal? The winner gets to share a pow poo with Kyrie. Uh, wait a minute. Uh oh. Okay, on my count. I don't want to share a pow poo with Kyrie. That sounds disgusting and illegal. Oh my god! Any route I want, huh? I swear I pressed jump. I swear I did. Okay, and then I guess I didn't do the zip line that I thought I was gonna do. I just don't understand when this game uh, is going to give me the permission to do the things I think I can do. I mean, obviously, he's the one who's going to share the pow poo with Kyrie, because that's gross. Oh, uh, can't go into the hole. I love the Destiny Islands. I can't believe I fell. No, can't go up there. I'm just stuck down here now. Can I just take this raft? No, I can't go out there. Well, what the heck, man? I'm sorry. The jumps did not work the way it looked like they were going to work. I jumped exactly how I thought the jump should go, and he just did not make it to the platform. Like, he straight up did not... I mean, do I seriously have to jump across these things? I believe I chose... Oh my god. Crikey. Oh, and then you actually can't do anything from the top of the tree. Oh my lord. Yeah, I remember my primary frustration with Kingdom Hearts was like trying to figure out exactly where a ledge was and just not knowing. It's like, it looks like you should be able to jump. I can make the jump at the ledge without jumping on top of the trees. Ah, uh, this is ins this is just completely ridiculous. Yeah, I remember uh, I played Kingdom Hearts 2 and the platforming was like a billion times better. Oh man, remastered the graphics. Make a jump to what? So what am I trying to do? This is, oh lord. And why can't you get on top of the tree? Ooh. This is completely wild. Yeah, and he won't climb up on that ledge. This is completely wild. Just like what an immediate immediate kick to the groin to have this. Okay, what what am I doing? I have to climb up to that ledge. I don't have to climb the trees. Okay, get I I just climb this thing. No. Can't climb that thing. I don't get this. I don't get this, man. What am I supposed to do? Oh, man. I was like so 100% just ready to chill with this game. I'm jumping too close to the ledge? What does that mean? Which ledge? I don't know what a ledge is, man. Okay, so I have to jump on top of these trees. I'm pretty sure I selected manual camera, so I don't know why the game keeps uh, adjusting the camera for me. That was horrifying. I made it though. It's hard to see where the ledges are. All right, well, I win.
Not the heck truck, huh? Riku sucks. I'm not even going to do it. I don't care. Yeah, I am upset at your joke. Your hurtful, evil joke. All I want to do now is kill Riku. I just want to kill Riku. And I don't care who knows it. The gummy ship will be named. Oh my god. I'm sorry, that's just so sinister. That a game with platforming like this... The, the first time there's a platforming challenge, it's just a... I just want to hang out at this obstacle course and try to understand it. That stupid bridge, man. It's just going to break every time I, I walk over it. You know how, like, in Uncharted, Nathan Drake... Uh, Nathan, Dr Nathan Drake can't get a break in Uncharted. Like, anytime you try to climb on a thing... Uh, anytime you ever try to climb on a thing right at the end he's gonna fall off all right where am i supposed to go now i don't understand i don't understand who i'm supposed to talk to now i'll go to the raft man This is like, here comes the bridge, here it comes. Oh, yeah. I find it hard to believe that uh, jumping across that thing is as funny as a... Uh... Oh, yes. Well, now I know how to win. Oh, she's at the raft. Hey, let's leave this jerkweed behind, bro. Provisions. One seagull egg, three mushrooms, two coconuts, three fish. Drinking water, but not from the ocean. Crikey. Grocery shopping in Disneyland, huh? Give me the coconuts. The way these coconuts aren't good. I have to find different coconuts. All I want is to get Donald in here. I want that wild idiot just... I want that wild weirdo. So wait, does that shortcut function as a... Uh, as an escape on the way back? Oh no, it doesn't. That wouldn't be helpful because during the obstacle course. No, that's not a good coconut. Yeah, I remember playing this game a long time ago and just... It was on one of those days where you got nothing else to do. There's a green coconut. What, I'm supposed to take the green ones? Oh, daddy's dead. Coconuts in my bread. Alright, where's it? Is that a fish? Oh, that was easy. Give me another one of those. Oh, I'm swimming with those... Can you imagine swimming with those big shoes on? Gives me a god darn stress nightmare thinking about swimming with shoes like this on. Uh, I needed an egg and drinking water. Drinking water, uh, more like a DW. 
give me that fish. That should be enough fish. That waterfall up there looks like it's DW. Give me that fresh dub. Yeah, I knew it. And I need an egg? Uh, where does me get egg? Where does me get egg? Oh, there, is that an egg on top of that tree there? That looks like an egg, yo. I'm gonna get this egg. Give me that egg. Oh, yeah. Now I need a mushroom. Mushrooms, uh, I believe they were talking about this cave earlier. Titus and Waka planning to go into this cave and cook for it, or whatever it is. We're gonna head in here. This is creepy. Oh, cave drawings. Give me that mushroom. Heck yeah, bro. <laughs> He's like, these drawings suck. Oh, memories. Sweet, sweet memories. Of a time long ago. When childhood was innocence. Man. Oh. Did he just draw... Is that himself feeding her a fruit? Or did he draw somebody else? come to see the door to this world. Did he huh? draw her feeding him this a fruit? Because that's weird connected. either way. Well, it's been connected. What are you talking about? Talking about? Tied to the darkness. Oh, yeah, just like Soon me. Soon to be completely eclipsed. Well, whoever <sighs> you are, stop freaking me out like this. Huh? Yeah. Well, well, where did you come from? You do not yet know. What lies beyond the door? God, this guy sounds cool. He sounds like so Kylo you're Ren. From another world. There is so very much to learn. Oh God, I'm ready. You understand so little. I'm ready to learn so much. Oh yeah? Well, you'll see. I'm gonna get out and learn I believe what's that out is there. Ansem. A meaningless effort. One who knows nothing. We're can being told the scene was added nothing. for the final mix. That's good. Dice Game Uchi in the chat says it's Jude Law. It's not Jude Law. It's Billy Zane. I love Billy Zane. I love the film The Phantom. Have you ever noticed that Jude Law's name looks like Judge Law? Like judges judge the law? Nothing really out of the ordinary. What, this door in this cave with no doorknob is not out of the ordinary? You need to grow up more questionable concerning your ordinary child. All right, let's get the heck off of this rock. Billy Zane is a master. The guy's a genius. Anyone who has not seen the film, The Phantom, Starring Billy Zane. You owe it to yourself. It is it is my favorite. I need another mushroom? Where is another mushroom? Mushroom where? Tell me now. I don't have time. Here comes the bridge. I swear I pressed the jump button. <laughs> At the right time. I really, really wish I'd pressed the jump button. I know, I, I'm pretty sure I did. 
That has got to be a mushroom. Okay. All right. I'm going to go ahead and tip this. I'm just going to hang out here for a second. Oh, hey, Kairi. I'm always pressing the wrong button. Oh, yeah? Are you trying to make a pow poo? I have the ingredients. What? You need three mushrooms? Crikey. You know, there's just almost no pain in a video game as bad as thinking you're done. Thinking that you're done with something. And then, uh... Being told you have to go find one more piece of nonsense. There's gotta be a mushroom down here somewhere. Right? Give me that disgusting mushroom. I'm only gathering these mushrooms because these people want them. I don't want them. What is it? She found something and it's mine? Yeah, let's go home. We got a question. What do you think Sora's toes look like if he needs shoes like that? I think he's got mean? toes the size of tangerines. Well Just a bunch of ripe okay? fruit settled at the tip of the Sora, tiptoes of a big old clown boot. Just the two of us. Fruit in the boot. <laughs> Just kidding. What's gotten into you? No, seriously. You're the one that is a good idea. Let's leave her here. Let's get out of here. You know, I was a little afraid at first. But now I'm ready. No matter where I go or what I see, I know I can always come back here. No. No, right? you can't come back here. Yeah, of course. That's good. So you cannot come back don't here. Ever huh? I'm sorry, I find I it preposterous that one 13 year old child would dare tell another, don't ever change. 13 year olds don't talk that way. Oh, Donald the letter. <laughs> Mickey Mouse writing the letter to Donald. Sorry to rush off without saying goodbye, but there's big trouble brewing. Not sure why, but the stars have been blinking out one by one, and that means disaster can't be far behind. I hate to leave you all, but I've got to go check into it. Can you believe Mickey Mouse used the word hate and disaster <laughs> on the same page of a friendly letter? And we got to find the guy with the key. We need that key or we're doomed. Mickey Mouse's bendy, bendy library. Apologize to Minnie. Man, he's like, tell my wife I'm gone. Oh dear, what could this mean? When Mickey Mouse finally shows up. It means we'll just have to trust the king. Tell, tell Minnie I'm gone. Why, why don't you just say show this letter to Minnie and let her see it too? Why are you telling another man to tell your wife? Why don't you talk to her, bro? When you finally meet Mickey, he's like such an alpha. Both of you. Mickey, Mickey's like totally wildly tough. He's like this murderous sort of Yoda style Star Wars Episode Two Jedi Master. Jiminy Cricket. Over here. This insignificant Cricket's insect will accompany you. Jiminy Cricket at your service. Oh my god, I love we that hope stupid for your cricket. Safe return. Please help the king. Okay. Oh, big goof. Yeah. All right. Gorsh, Jiminy. Uh, gorsh. Oh, we got our first gorsh. That's our first gorsh of the game. We were scattered. Goofy having a helmet that sits on top of his head is the most like it's just the most 
apocalyptically yeah, comical world, thing in the world to me. We can't let on where we're and that's where I signed up for this we game. Gotta protect the world I was like, I knew I was going to get all the way through this game. Right. You know, I knew it when I first started playing it back in 2002. But, uh, dude. Guess we'll need new duds when we get dude, there. When, I, when I saw that his little tiny hat that usually sits atop his head is replaced with a full helmet uh, with, you know, beaver and all. Um, just like a suit of armor helmet sitting on top of his head. I just immediately was like, this is the dumbest thing in the world and I need it. I was like, this is mine now. The gummy ship is so cool in Kingdom Hearts 2. That's all I have to say about that. <laughs> Donald Duck's voice just burbling out of this horn. Chip and Dale rescue rangering it up. I want Chip and Dale to be with me all the time. I want them to be in my backpack. I want them to just be my backpack buddies all day. In real life. Not in this video game. I don't care about this video game. Oh, blast off, gummy ship. Uh. Oh my god, thumbs up and a wink from Donald Big D Duck. He's just the big dog, Duck. In your weird PlayStation 1 boat. Falling into a hole. Oh my god. The Magic Kingdom standing on a meatball. Orchestra hit as they exit. So wait. True or false? Scrooge McDuck is in Kingdom Hearts 3. True or false, everybody? Let me know. can't wait. Once we set sail, it'll be great. I just can't wait till we set sail when we ride on this Storm? whale. Pinocchio will oh, be no, there too. The raft. Oh, your raft is going to get struck by light, bro. Sora, dinner's ready. And Come yes, Scrooge down. McDuck is in Kingdom Sora? Hearts 3. And <laughs> I love it. I want to jump in that money bin. You know what, Scrooge McDuck swimming in his money bin, that's just been pretty much modern video game design. Just seeks to emulate the catharsis What's of... That? Watching a man swim in a a bunch of money. Boat and Kyrie's. My friends are dead. Oh no! This is getting hot. But unfortunately, I have to end the stream now. Oh, the heartless. It's not that difficult to understand. The heartless are. Uh, they're just they're just god darn people. Okay, get get out of here. I gotta run. They're just people who've lost their uh, their their goodness. The darkness has overcome them. No, those are nobodies. What? There's nobodies and there's heartless. That's all you need to know. Nobodies are people who don't have buddies. And heartless are people who don't have hearts. It's not god darn rocket science, everybody. I really just want to save my game and and end this stream because I have to go. Let's go on into the seaside shack. I really want to just kill those guys with my wooden sword. I want to just blast them to death with my wooden sword. Well, everyone, we've done it. We've gotten uh, all, we've almost gotten up to the Keyblade in Kingdom Hearts One, and uh, pretty soon, pretty soon, we're gonna have an even better time. Because I gotta have that goddamn Donald Duck. Uh, Donald Duck is my my real best friend, and maybe we'll be back a little bit more of this. Maybe Friday, uh, maybe Friday I'll uh, I'll chill down with some more of this for a little bit more of a time. The problem is I would then have to refrain from playing the game until Friday, and I would I would like to play it some more tonight. You know, when I'm through with my business. But anyway, look at that timer on the screen just ticking up. The seconds ticking up. It's kind of, you know, making me uh, making me nervous. Anyway, everyone, this has been uh, this has been KHFM on Kotaku.com.
and I'll see you all later. Because uh, you know why? Why wouldn't we? Uh, why wouldn't we be back later, right? I I I would really like to. Yeah, I just wanted to want to play more of this because it's fun. Video games forever, everybody. Uh, Kotaku.com. Goodbye. <laughs>